This is a comparison review of the unique Kurotoga and the Zebra Del Guard. I've seen a lot of posts that picks between the two in a this or that situation. The truth is, they are not that similar. They are both pretty different pens that have very different mechanisms at work for a slightly similar purpose. They both advertise decrease in lead breakage but they both go about this in different ways. The unique Kurotoga uses a unique clutch system called the Kurotoga engine that rotates the pencil lead in small increments to ensure a sharper edge with a wider diameter that decreases the chance for the lead to break. When the Kurotoga engine works, it works well. It writes with a spongy, springy feeling from the clutch being rotated, and the lines you get are sharp and thin that have consistent widths. When it's not though, it's not that bad, you only get thicker lines like a normal mechanical pencil. I find that the mechanism of the Kurotoga works only as well as the position you write with. It has an optimal position for the mechanism to truly work and slight deviations from that then you get to experience some problems with the mechanism not being pushed enough to rotate the lead which might even lead to lead breakage. I would recommend the Kurotoga if you write at a high angle with a low grip as this is the best writing position when using the Kurotoga. If you also write using more short strokes, then you will benefit from having uniform lines when using the Kurotoga. Next is the Zebra Del Guard, which uses the Del Guard system, a double suspension type system that protects the lead from breaking due to extreme pressure from both vertical and diagonal directions. The Del Guard system works by absorbing pressure from direct force on the lead, protecting it from breaking. It also works when the pencil lead is applied diagonal pressure by having the lead sleeve protrude to protect the lead. The Delgar system is the better designed of the two. It works without effort. In most positions, it works well and is unobtrusive. You don't notice that the pencil is using an engineered suspension system. It works without feeling weird. Unlike the Kurotoga with the springy, spongy feeling, there is some springy feeling in the Delgard, but only when extreme pressure is applied and it doesn't affect the quality of the lines. I would recommend the Delgard for anyone who wants a quality mechanical pencil, but it's especially recommended for those who use mechanical pencils for long periods of writing or drawing. Also, for those who use softer lead in their pens, the Delgard is perfect for them. That's it for my comparison between the Unicura Toga and the Zebra Delgard. Tell me in the comments which one you prefer. And if you like this review, please hit that like button. And if you want more in-depth reviews of the Kura Toga and the Delgard, I have uploaded some videos showcasing each of them as well. If you enjoy pen reviews, please subscribe. Thanks, and until the next one.